just a slight interruption here. I wanted to apologize for the fact of this video is filmed so close. It was actually originally filmed on my phone for Instagram. And so that's why when you edit it, pulled it in. I would like to also say that the history on that dresser, I got that dresser at an antique store and I asked the gentleman that was selling it how much he wanted for it. He said $15 to which my sister told me, if you don't buy it, I will. And it wasn't until about a year later that I actually renovated it. So let's get back. Guys, it is the day to paint these chest drawers. I'm not telling you guys what color was picked yet. You just have to wait and see. But first I do have to sand this color off first. And then I also have to fix these little spots here. I'm just gonna put some wood filler over it and smooth it out. And then we'll get started on the rest. Let's see. So I've got the first drawer done and I will tell you, I got, I started sanding and I got through the green and there was white paint after that. So I finally got through all of it, took a few course pads and I made sure that as I went, you know, you want to go evenly across, otherwise you'll get divots in your wood. So, and also me, ooh, that mask was tight. Me not knowing exactly what kind of wood this was, I didn't want to take that chance of it messing it up. But guys, look at this. Look at this. It's going to be so pretty when I stain it natural. How about that? What do you guys think? It's going to be so pretty. Now, this is where the knobs were. The pulls are right here. I didn't want to dig further in because the knobs, the pulls are going to cover that anyway. So that'll be fine. But that is going to be gorgeous as a natural stain. I can't wait. And I got the sides. The sides are really easy to get off. I think it's just they just kind of slapped it on there pretty quickly since it was just the sides. But I've got two more to go. Let's do this. Okay, so now I just need to wipe them down, get all the dust off because there's a green, of course, you know, you've sanded all this stuff. We give wipe them all down, drawers too, and then we're gonna start painting and you guys get to see what color we picked. sanded down to the color that the wood is so I am just going to use a polyurethane just a clear gloss on top just to bring out the natural wood I don't want to change the color of the wood and then I can shine up the brass handles or the pools whatever you want to call them I don't know but this stuff is stinky so let's get started on this So while this sitting dries, I'm going to shine up the pools and see if I can get them a little better. They're really dull and I don't know. We'll see what happens. All right. So I'm going to try this Brasso, metal polished Brasso. And this is what the handles look like. I know it's kind of hard to see here and the way everything, the light is reflecting, but you can see they're kind of dull. You see it? So... We'll see. They got some weight to them though. We'll see what happens. We'll see if it. I'm gonna take a before and after picture. would 
guessed. They looked so yellow before. So now I'm gonna put them back on the drawers. When I say it turned out so beautiful, you guys have to see. Check it out. Funny story on this dresser. When I first saw it, it was at an antique store. I don't know why I'm still looking up here. I first saw this dresser at an antique store. Um, I have no idea why I keep looking up here. There's nothing up there.